Okay, here. Um, this is the type of bipod I would recommend using on a, the animals are coming in close range and moving a lot of, uh, moving quickly laterally left and right. Um, is one with a swivel on the front where you can pan back and forth just like that. Uh, this also can tilt real well and it does have uh, legs that extend out and contract um, but when you're gonna most importantly when you're gonna target an animal that might be moving around a lot having the ability to swivel and pan back and forth um, it's going to permit you to acquire the target much faster. The animals are going to stop, fiddle around, move somewhere else. Uh, if you have something that doesn't swivel here and is static, when you try to rotate and, and get back on the target or follow a target, these two legs here are going to drag on the ground. They're probably going to make noise and even expose your position. They're going to be a problem at some point. You're probably going to want this type of bipod. Maybe not this brand. This is an AccuTac. I'll put the exact model in the description. And right now I'm just going to give you um, a close-up look of what this particular bipod uh, looks like. Um, this has a, a knob here or a lever here where I can loosen or tighten um, this where I can loosen or tighten up this feature here, which is the where you rotate it on it and back and forth. Um, there's also another lever behind here, which is going to give you the tilt. It's going to give you um, both of these are going to increase or decrease the amount of friction you need to either tilt or rotate your bipod. Um, I, I think they're really useful, and uh, everybody might tune theirs slightly differently, but I really like them.